Welcome, curious minds, to Unearthed Mysteries, Lost Cities, and Civilizations. Our quest to uncover the secrets of the past will take us to the farthest corners of the world, where once great civilizations thrived, only to vanish mysteriously, leaving behind traces of their grandeur and wonder. Join us as we step back in time and walk in the footsteps of those who came before us, seeking to understand the tales of these lost cities. From the towering temples of the Mayans to the hidden chambers of the Indus Valley, each civilization has left behind a legacy that captivates the imagination of archaeologists, historians, and adventurers alike. Together, we'll venture into the heart of these historical enigmas, shedding light on the stories that time forgot and finding inspiration in the remnants of once thriving societies. Let's start by exploring the majestic legacy of the Khmer Empire. From the 9th to the 15th century, this powerful empire ruled over much of Southeast Asia, leaving behind a remarkable cultural and architectural heritage. The Khmer kings built grand temples and cities, including the magnificent Angkor Wat, as symbols of their devotion and authority. The empire's influence extended far beyond its borders, and its history is a tapestry of greatness and innovation. Angkor Wat, the crown jewel of the Khmer Empire, is a masterpiece of religious architecture. It was originally built as a Hindu temple dedicated to the god Vishnu, but later transformed into a Buddhist temple. The symbolism and intricate design of Angkor Wat reflect the spiritual beliefs of the time, and its bas reliefs tell stories from Hindu and Buddhist epics. This sacred site has been a place of worship, pilgrimage, and contemplation for generations. Archaeological excavations at Angkor Wat and its surrounding areas have yielded a treasure trove of insights into the Khmer civilization. From uncovering hidden structures to deciphering ancient inscriptions, researchers have pieced together the intricate details of daily life, religious practices, and the architectural techniques employed in creating this monumental complex. Each discovery brings us closer to understanding the brilliance of the Khmer people. The legacy of Angkor Wat and the Khmer Empire continues to inspire and amaze. The site's designation as a UNESCO World Heritage Site highlights its global significance, and efforts are ongoing to preserve and protect this invaluable piece of human history. As we stand in awe of the temple in the jungle, Let's also remember the importance of safeguarding these cultural treasures for future generations. Today, we're embarking on a journey back in time to uncover the fascinating world of the Inca civilization. And at the heart of it all, we find the awe-inspiring city of Machu Picchu. The Incas were masters of engineering, and their ingenuity shines through in every stone of this incredible citadel. Let's talk about the marvels of Machu Picchu's construction. The Incas didn't just build a city, they created a masterpiece. The precision with which the stones were cut and fitted together without the use of modern tools is nothing short of astonishing. It's a testament to their advanced engineering skills and their deep connection with the natural world around them. Many theories have been put forth about the purpose of Machu Picchu, but the truth remains shrouded in mystery. Was it a royal retreat, a sacred ceremonial center, or something even more profound? The purpose of this magnificent citadel continues to intrigue historians and archaeologists, and we'll explore some of these captivating theories. As we ponder the purpose of Machu Picchu, we're also confronted with the puzzle of its abandonment. What led to the city's eventual decline? Some believe it was the Spanish conquest, while others point to environmental changes. We'll examine these theories and discuss the impact they had on the fate of this remarkable site. Though Machu Picchu was lost to the world for centuries, it was rediscovered in the early 20th century, rekindling our fascination with the Inca civilization. The site's designation as a UNESCO World Heritage Site highlights its significance, and efforts to preserve its legacy are ongoing. It's a reminder of the enduring impact of the Incas on our world.
Let's start by exploring life in Pompeii before the catastrophic eruption. This bustling city, located near the Bay of Naples, was a hub of Roman society. Its citizens went about their daily routines, from visiting the vibrant marketplaces to enjoying the luxurious baths. We'll uncover the details of their lives, the diversity of their society, and the ways in which they thrived within the Roman Empire. Then came the fateful day when Mount Vesuvius unleashed its fury upon Pompeii. In 79 AD, the city was buried under layers of volcanic ash and pumice, sealing its fate and preserving its tragic story for centuries to come. We'll discuss the events leading up to the eruption, the impact on the city's inhabitants, and the eerie silence that fell over Pompeii. What's truly remarkable about Pompeii is the level of preservation. The layers of ash that covered the city acted as a time capsule, protecting the buildings, art, and even the daily items used by its residents. This has allowed us to gain incredible insights into Roman life, architecture, and culture. We'll marvel at the well-preserved structures, such as the forum, villas, and even the haunting plaster casts of the victims. Beyond the tragedy, Pompeii offers us a unique opportunity to glimpse into the heart of ancient Roman culture. We can learn about their social hierarchy, their religious practices, and the importance of art in their daily lives. The colorful frescoes and intricate mosaics tell stories of love, mythology, and the pursuit of beauty. It's a testament to the rich tapestry of human history that Pompeii has preserved. Let's start by delving into the splendor of the great Zimbabwe. This awe-inspiring city, located in modern-day Zimbabwe, flourished between the 11th and 15th centuries. It was the heart of a vibrant civilization that controlled extensive trade routes, connecting the interior of Africa to the coast. The Great Zimbabwe was a center of wealth, culture, and innovation, leaving an indelible mark on the history of the continent. What truly sets the Great Zimbabwe apart are its architectural marvels. The city is renowned for its intricate stone walls, some of which reach up to 36 feet in height. These stone walls, without the use of mortar, display incredible precision in their construction. The great enclosure with its iconic conical tower is a testament to the advanced engineering skills of its builders. We'll take a closer look at these remarkable structures and discuss the fascinating techniques used in their creation. Beyond its breathtaking architecture, the Great Zimbabwe played a pivotal role as a bustling trading hub. It was strategically positioned along the trade routes that connected the interior of Africa with the Indian Ocean coast. The city's inhabitants engaged in extensive trade, exchanging goods such as gold, ivory, and pottery. The artifacts discovered at the Great Zimbabwe offer valuable insights into the complex web of commerce that once thrived here. Sadly, the Great Zimbabwe's glory days eventually came to an end. The reasons for its decline are still debated among historians and archaeologists. Some speculate that environmental factors such as deforestation may have played a role. Others point to shifts in trade routes and changing political dynamics. Despite the decline, the legacy of the Great Zimbabwe endures, and its mysteries continue to inspire exploration and research. Our journey begins with the quest for Atlantis. Plato's writings first introduced us to this fabled city, said to be an advanced civilization with great wealth and knowledge. But the exact location has remained elusive, fueling countless expeditions and speculations. Was Atlantis a real place, a figment of imagination, or a metaphorical tale? Let's delve into the intriguing possibilities. Throughout history, numerous theories have emerged about where Atlantis might have been situated. From the Mediterranean to the Caribbean, from the Canary Islands to the depths of the Atlantic Ocean itself, the search has taken us to some intriguing places. Some believe it's hidden beneath the waves, while others speculate it might be a sunken island. We'll explore these captivating theories and the evidence behind them. One of the most fascinating aspects of Atlantis is the advanced technology attributed to its inhabitants. 
According to some accounts, they possessed knowledge far beyond their time, with achievements in engineering, architecture, and more. Could they have harnessed energy sources we're unaware of? Did they have a profound understanding of ancient sciences? Let's ponder these captivating possibilities. But perhaps the most intriguing question of all is what led to the disappearance of Atlantis. Did a catastrophic event, such as a volcanic eruption or a tsunami, wipe out this advanced civilization? Or did they possess a wisdom that allowed them to leave the physical realm, transcending into another dimension? We'll explore the significance of Atlantis's disappearance and the impact it has had on our collective imagination.